Jack Savile, welcome to Aldershot Town. Thank you very much. And I'm sure you had options, so why, why have you chosen Aldershot Town? Um, opportunity more than anything. The manager, um, I've heard he's, he's quite a good manager. Um, it's close to my house, um, and it's in the conference, and it's a big club in the conference. It's a good opportunity to play a full season of games and, and kick on for myself and for all the show as well, to be fair. And what, what are your first impressions of Barry Smith? Yeah, lovely man, good good manager, um, serious when he needs to be, but got a sense of humour as well, so really happy to be fair. And as you said, you're, you're from Camberley, you, you played a few games on trial here in 2010, so maybe you knew a little bit about the club already as well? Yeah, I did, yeah. I think, I, was it 2010? Was it was five years ago. <laughs> that long ago? Wow. Um, yeah, so I think that was, yeah. Um, I know a bit about the club. I, know, I don't think I know any of the boys now, actually, to be fair. Uh, no one was here. I knew Adam Mecky, but he's obviously not here. Um, but no, I'm really pleased to be here, to be fair, and it's a good opportunity for me. And you arrive known for, for your versatility. Would you say you're primarily a centre back or? Yeah, left side of centre half would be my main position. Um, but I can play left back, I can play holding midfield. Um, I think I was sub goalie actually once last <laughs> season for Barnet, so yeah, I can play anywhere really. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I guess has, has that been discussed? That, that uh, versatility? Kind of, kind of, but I think, I think he's looking to play me left side of centre half, to be fair, so I'm pleased with that one. Yeah. And what, what sort of defender are you? What would you say your main strengths are? Um, good in the air. Um, I'm good at playing out from the back as well, to be fair, which is what, what he wants to do, which is actually another reason why why I did sign here. Um, he said he wants me to f defend first, but he wants me to play from the back, so it's perfect, really. Yeah. Definitely, yeah, and that, that open attacking football is something that, that Barry has said. That's been a big part of his remit for coming here, and I suppose that's, yeah. that's something that you, that you agree with, that's something you can, you can bring to the team. No, definitely. It's very attractive for, for a young young player who wants to sort of push on with his career. He doesn't just want to hoof it and kick it. He wants to, to improve as a footballer. You need to do the football thing, you know. So that was one of the main reasons why I did look at all the shot more than my other offers. Yeah. And you, you were a big part of Barnet's success last year, but I guess that opportunity to play, to be first choice to play regularly week in, week out, is something that, that you need. You need it as a, as a footballer, especially at 24 years old. You need to play four seasons of football. Um, I wasn't going to play at Barnet. Um, I did play a lot last year, to be fair, but I don't think I would have played. Um, he's very keen on his two centre halves that he's got now. Uh, so for me to step out of that and, and kick on with all the shot is it's a good opportunity for me. And you've seen what it takes for a side to win the title. I think Barnet rose from eighth. To champions last season, what was was there anything that you identified as being as being the, the factor in in why the team went from just missing out on the playoffs to, to winning the title? Probably John Akinde. <laughs> I was I was going to say it can't have just been the fact that you had John Akinde up front, but uh, no, he was a massive massive yeah. difference. Uh, I'm not going to lie, he was he is at times you, you can't mark him. You try and mark him in training and stuff. He is a very strong. Very good, good player. Um, but no, the manager was the manager's the manager, we all know with Martin Allen. Um, just a good, good group of boys. Stacky, the goalie, Gids, the right back. We had a good, firm team who all got on very, very well, which helped massively on and off the pitch, you know? Yeah, and it, it, it seemed to be, and maybe great examples, the two games against Aldershot Town, that it was small margins, that it was that. that Ability to even when not playing at your best yeah. to still get results. Still get results, yeah. Well, I think, like I said, it come, comes down to Johnny Kinde again. I think he scored an own goal and then scored a hat trick. Yeah. But we didn't play well that game, to be fair. But yeah, like you said, we did, we did win it. Um, mm. That starts from the back. I think that starts from the defence, the goalie. As long as we're keeping clean sheets or whatever, or letting only one in, we knew we were going to score goals because we scored a lot of goals, you know. So. That, that was good. Yeah, yeah. And I guess it's ambitious that the aim is to try and, as much as possible, replicate that sort of success next season. Yeah, I think well, Barry's, that Barry's aim is to, is to reach the playoffs. Definitely. I think we can. Big enough club, we've got the facilities. 
got the manager. Uh, from what I've known, I know what I know of the players. Good players. There's there's no reason why not. If we stick together as a team and and try and perform together, then that's what I'm looking for. I don't want to just play a football season and not care where we come. I want to push on and go up, make the playoffs, or at least try. You know. <laughs>